Hey guys, it's Paul here from the Running Injury Free Revolution and we're here at, in Paris at the Champs-Élysées, just the top where you've got the Arc de Triomphe behind us. The start line is about 400 metres that way uh, and everyone's coming in just to get going with their, their waves. They'll go through right till about 10.30 and we just wanted to talk about starting running because a lot of people probably don't think that they could do a marathon and you, you all can and uh, what I want to do is just show you a few of the little pieces with getting started because most people just bust it out and run and sometimes uh, you can it, it can be uncomfy for you you can start to not enjoy it because you kind of don't do it right probably what I want you to understand is that um, at Riff Rev we always talk about technique and if you get that right from the outset it's really powerful so we're going to do a little bit of a series but I just wanted to introduce it to you quickly so we always talk about LLRS at, um, at Riff Rev and basically that stands for your four rules or your four ways that you can use for running and, and, and LLRS stands for length, lean, relax and shoulders so length being linked through your body so always be long and tall Lean is actually your, your lean from your ankle. So you use your lean and then you're gonna use that lean so that your tipping point is actually taking you forward, not your power of your muscles. Then relax, your feet should be relaxed at all times. And basically friction should literally just be taking them backwards. And then shoulders, make sure that your shoulders are just uh, relaxed and going for the ride. So there are your four strategies when you're first starting. Start to think about that. We'll go through them piece by piece. But guys, you can get into it. Start today and next year you might be here at the Arc de Triomphe starting the Paris Marathon. Hey guys, Paul here from Running Injury Free Revolution. And we're here at the Paris Marathon. We're at the 28K mark. We're on Concord. Uh, the Louvre's about a kilometre and a half that way. But um, these guys are really starting to feel it now. But we're talking about getting into running and starting to, to work towards a goal of maybe a marathon. It might be a couple of years off, but you all can do it. Uh, we talked about LLRS and, and um, length, lean, relax, and shoulders. I just wanted to go through it piece by piece. And, and your first piece is length. So when you're starting running, making sure that you're using your body because a lot of us runners, particularly when we start, we'll, we'll sort of flex from the hips uh, and that changes your lever arm. Uh, it does a lot of things. It really messes with your biomechanics, your knees, your ankles, your hips, all of those things. So your length is important and the way that you get your length, I always think about your, your body positioning. If I am standing, what I want to do is, is almost um, be aware of uh, sort of shoulder width apart with my feet. Uh, and then what I can do just to get my position is lean forward a millimetre, lean back a millimetre and I can keep rocking till I find my weight over my central arches in my foot. So basically weight even front and back. And then from that position I'm almost uh, got my straight legs but they're not locked. So it's, it's a, a straight knee but it's not a, a locked knee like that. Okay. Um, and then I imagine a piece of string through the crown of my head taking me long. So the length is actually through the back of my neck and soft through my, my chin. So if you ever want to be as long as you can possibly be, that's the way you'll always get that position. That's basically the position that you want to run in. So length through the body, really, really important because it's your mechanics. Uh, and then what you can do is start to use your mechanics in that you can start to lean. And we'll talk about that leaning from the ankles in our next video. So guys, um, yeah, we got people here at, at just about to get into that sort of 30, 32 K mark in the marathon. So they're, they're probably starting to hurt a little bit right now, but um, it's, it's going to be fun for them. They're almost, almost through, but um, great little journey. You guys can actually do it as well. Start simple, guys. We'll talk about how to get started. You're just going to do little things at the start of your journey. Make it comfy. Make it fun, because running is awesome, guys, and it can take you to amazing places, meet amazing friends. Just come from Concord. We're now just at the Eiffel Tower. The guys are running past the Eiffel Tower and then they'll actually come up for the last 10k around the park and then finish near the Arc de Triomphe. But we're talking about our, our introduction to running and, and looking at your LLRS, your length, lean, relax and shoulders. We talked about length before, so using your body position. Now we want to talk about leaning uh, because what most runners do is most runners will be very upright. Um, but then what they'll do is they'll stay upright. So, so the only way to move forward is to sort of stride out and then create force by pushing with their, their glutes, their hammies, their, their calves. So what you can do to put less pressure through your joints and also use less energy is you can actually use your body position or your lean. 
So if you're looking at your lean, it's it's length, and then you're gonna lean from your ankles. So basically it's lean through here. I, there's a tipping point at which I need to take a step. So if I don't take this step, I'm gonna fall on my nose. So what you can do is you can start to actually run on that tipping point. So again, it's length, lean forward, and then gravity is out in front of me. It's actually gonna take me take me forward. So you use a lot less pressure, you put a lot less pressure through all your joints as well. So just be careful with that because what uh, beginner runners will do is they'll use their length really well and then when they lean, they'll lean forward and then they'll flex from their hips. So they'll do that and then they'll lock themselves up. So um, just be aware, it's length, um, keep yourself long through your middle, okay? So it's two really important things, length, lean, we're going to look at relax and shoulders next. We've got the Paris Marathon here guys, there. we've got about 10k to go, so they're literally coming into the park, um, the Eiffel Tower is just straight that way, so they're almost home, they'll be, they'll be in a bit of trouble I reckon, they'll be, they'll be feeling it. But we wanted to talk about your beginning running and how you're going to get into it without injuries and without sort of using too much energy, you don't want to bust your butt too much so that you sort of kind of don't enjoy it. Um, so we talked about LLRS and um, we talked about length, we talked about lean, we want to talk about relax today because what you want to do is make sure that you're relaxing your, your legs. A lot of runners will stay very upright and then what they have to do is they have to create their movement by striding out in front, a heel strike which is a braking force and then they will actually have to push. So, so quads, calves, you'll see them literally so they have to push through. So um, uh, what we want is just to have our legs completely relaxed. So if we go back to our first two rules, which is use our length, use our lean. If, if we start to run on that tipping point, our legs can just completely relax. So it's length, lean, and then your legs just literally go for the ride. Um, so what you can do is just to start to think about your feet just being completely relaxed, your legs being completely relaxed. Everything above the waist with running will be going forward and gravity will be taking you forward. Um, everything below the waist will be going backwards. So the friction um, will, will just be literally kicking your legs backwards. So start to think about relaxing your feet, relaxing your legs while you run. This is the finish line of the Paris Marathon. We've been going through your beginning running strategies today and basically uh, we talked about LLRS, so your length, lean, relax, and shoulders. So your fourth rule is basically to, to be very aware of your shoulders because a lot of runners, particularly when we're starting, is we'll get a lot of tension through our shoulders and you get trigger points, little nasty little spots, pain in your shoulders that can really fire up and again can sort of sometimes put you off. So basically when you're running, just check them all the time. Just check that your shoulders are relaxed um, and, and they're, they're loose at all times. So four strategies, length, lean, relax, and shoulders. So use your length, make sure you're aware of your lean, that your gravity is taking you forward, that you're relaxing your legs so that they're just literally going for the ride. The body is actually, the top half of the body is going forward, the bottom half of the body is going backwards. So very relaxed feet, calves, quads, um, your, your whole legs and then be very aware of your shoulders. If you put those four pieces together, you're gonna to use less energy, you're gonna actually um, put a lot less pressure through your body. So if you're starting to run, you're more likely to be able to just start busting out those short little runs and start extending them uh, more and more and more. So you can do it guys, we're at the Paris Marathon, there's no reason why uh, you can't start today and be here next year or the year after. Um, start working towards it now, but have fun with your running. We're gonna show you some more strategies of how to look after um, your, your distances leading into your longer stuff as you get more experience. But guys, we're signing off from Paris. We're off to Boston next, so keep an eye out for the series we'll do over there. But guys, I'm Paul from Running Injury Free Revolution. Check us out at riffrev.com.